top five most difficult people in the workplace. Every workplace has its share of difficult people. It might be the boss who loses their temper at the drop of a hat. I thought Paul was putting them on no, the system. No, that's your job. Or the person who spreads rumours and gossip. I just heard there was some kind of trouble and, you know, he'd been given the push. Or who's always got an excuse for not doing something. Just go in, do my hours and get out. We've listed five of our most difficult people in the workplace and some tips on how to handle them. One, the steamroller. Steamrollers like to shout and bully to get what they want and won't let anyone get in their way. Get me a run right now! So stand your ground, breathe deeply, and make it clear that you'll have the conversation when they calm down and behave reasonably. This is absolutely bloody ridiculous. Please don't swear at me, Mrs. Kusumana. I'm trying to help you. Two, the shirker. Got someone on your team who's always got an excuse for not doing something? I ain't doing extra work for no money, you know what I'm saying? Chances are they're bored or they just lack the confidence to tackle new challenges. I think I'd like it better if I didn't get treated like a complete idiot. So give them support and a chance to shine, and you might be surprised. 3. The Sniper Snipers like to secretly undermine their colleagues with covert criticism, gossip and rumours. I hear he left his last call under a bit of a cloud. Really? Calling them on their behaviour and bringing them out into the open makes it harder for them to operate. So don't give them a place to hide. 4. The Pleaser I'll do it. Pleasers might not seem like a problem. They're the people who are always willing to jump in and help out. Yeah, no problems. <laughs> Sorted. But they often tend to overcommit themselves and end up letting others down. So always check that you've really got their buy-in first and tell them it's fine to say no. 5. The Downer Downers haven't got anything good to say about anyone or anything. God, no, not them again. They're on a downward cycle of despair, even when everything's going great. But a lot of their behavior is just about getting attention. I'm just trying to be realistic. So make use of their critical faculties, but without encouraging their negativity. Difficult people can cause huge damage to working relationships and cost your organization time and money. Find out how to manage difficult people with understanding problem behavior from Skill Boosters.